Thank you all for coming in person and also online to welcome to Emmett's Place. Thank you for tuning in on the drums from Indiana, Pennsylvania. That's Mr. Joe Saylor. <laughs> on the double bass from Raleigh, North Carolina, my main man, Philip Norris. And uh, we have one of the great trumpet players in the world in, in the history of this music. Uh, he's someone who's, who's omnipresent in New York. You know, you, anytime you're in Europe, you look around, you see his poster somewhere. He's always appearing. And uh, it's because he's always uplifting people with his music. He's always on the scene. And he's also a historian of the music, written uh, three, three volumes of his book, Griot. Griot. Is that how you pronounce it? And uh, we'll get to that a little bit later. And uh, but I want to introduce from New York City one of the greats of our time. That's Mr. Jeremy Pelt. That last one we played, of course, was T for Two. We started with a composition called Beautiful Friendship. And uh, we'd like to play Falling in Love with Love. Sure.
about it one more time for Emmett Cohen. Yeah. 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 Well, it's a pleasure to be here after uh, so many years. You know, he's talking about how you go around Europe and you see pictures of, you know, posters of me and, you know, half of that's true, but the other half is that I see posters of him. And I can't be happier to see it. You know, this is one of the most enterprising gentlemen I know, which accounts for why he's always in demand. And uh, he's doing the right thing, and so are his cohorts. I remember meeting him when he first moved to town. <laughs> yes, indeed. And he's still playing well, and uh, I said still playing well like he'd be sad by now. No, no, you know, he's, he's doing his thing. <laughs> and I know. <laughs> and then, of course, you know, my man over here. So, I'm, you know, I'm talking like this because I'm actually closer to 50 than I am that age, so I can <laughs> And uh, it's a pleasure to, to uh, hear the, the, what Freddie used to call young talent. And uh, well, they doing it. That's all I'm gonna say. And uh, what are we gonna play next? End of a love affair. End of a love affair. All right.
How about it for Jeremy Pelt? <laughs> Joe Saylor on the drums. That's Phil Norris on the bass. Um, as you are probably aware, these shows, uh, it takes a lot to put them on, and we have some special thank yous to the sponsors to make. Uh, we would like to thank David Chapman, uh, Pam and Bob Adams, Penny Ray Foote, and Steve and uh, Jenny Brownwin. Thank you so much for contributing to make this, make this operation run. And uh, also we got our sponsor drink called Bimble. It's got CBD in it. Do you like one? <laughs> Uh, good news is Jeremy only lives about uh, four blocks away, so. <laughs> <laughs> How long you been in Harlem? Uh, 25 years. 25 years, wow. Yeah. Yeah. I've only been here 11, so. <laughs> um, where should we go from there? I'm going to do something uh, from the songbook of one of my favorites, Donald Byrd. It's a song that he wrote called The Bird House.
Thank you very much for tuning in. Once again, Joe Saylor at the drums. <laughs> Philip Norris at the bass. <laughs> the one and only Jeremy Pelt on the trumpet. <laughs> We'd like to thank our sponsors, David Chapman, pa Pam and Bob Adams, Penny and Ray Foote, and Steve and Jenny Brownwin, and, uh, and, and our drink over there, Bimble. You can see it over there. And uh, yeah, we thank you. We want to thank Alex Whites on video design. Give it up. Yeah. Kelvin Grant on the sound. Yeah. We want to give a big shout out to Fumi Ononaye, watching at home, who is, uh, is, is recovering. And we're sending him our love. And uh, he had a big part in, in putting us all together. He worked A&R for uh, he still does, and uh, we, Fumi, we love you if you're watching at home, and this concert is dedicated to you, and uh, we're going to take you home with the slow blues.